Yeah. Well, Elizabeth, I gotta give it to you. You win the bet. You're all right. You could make Stephen hand over Hessian eyes, all our peacekeepers, all our fine soldiers and sailors and airmen. I guess you, I guess you left him with the army just in case he needed it to, <clears throat> the Canadians got pissed off and now you're loyal subjects or whatever. Blah, 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 blah. So, anyhow, you win the bet. I owe you a buck. Clearly, you have total control over Stephen. So, there's your buck. Come and get it. Funny thing is that you gotta remember about those uh, those uranium ponds. When a planet goes to singularity, well, that the dense energetic matter, you know, goes first. So you know you don't want to leave it in there too long, or you'll end up at the center of the Earth. Well, the center of the singularity. The Earth will be at the center of the singularity too. <sighs> Truth and survival, eh? Steven? Yeah, I guess you are the better man than me. And, um, the better bird. Hey, you win. I owe you a buck. <clears throat> you could completely sell out Canada with less than a 20% minority and get the other 80% that never authorized you to hold power of attorney over them to do absolutely nothing while well, you, well, you, you know, took the joint and handed it to your globalist buddies. So, you win. Here's your buck. Come and get it. Same thing, I wouldn't wait too long on that. You might, you know. You guys are winners. Unlike me. It was a good bet. I just, I owe somebody else a buck. I bet them that you guys wouldn't go this far. And you did, especially for a $1 bet. <clears throat> You're such sporting competitive beasts. <clears throat>